have something I wanted to show you. Mm -hmm. uh, did that, did what you stepped on or stepped near, did it look anything like this? Yes. What? Yeah, can it had the leaves. It had, it was a Can shield. you see the leaves up there? It had the leaves across the top. And then the only thing was that it had a date that I, it was, it was, oh, 20, I thought it was 27. That, yeah, a lot of them would have that. This is a, this is a broken mm -hmm. uh, grave marker from that, from that general time era. With the minute you saw, minute you talked about having the wreaths, these leaves up on top. This is one of the anomalies that I've collected over the years. I've never, I don't have any of them that are even close to this. It's the first time I've actually gotten one with, with the, the wreath on it. So, and so, so that says the uh, G A R. So that's the Grand uh, Army of the Republic. This would have been, this would have been placed on a veteran's grave, and then a flag would have been placed here. But over the years, what happens? You'll see, like the stem here is broken off, yeah. and they would be like this in the grave, usually on front or to the side of the actual marker, the Grand Army of the Republic marker that would have been provided by a post. And a lot of people would step on these. And that's basically where this one came from. Oh, fascinating. Okay. We have wow. a bunch of those in the basement. Do you oh, really? That right? That's yep. cool. That's we have awesome, a tombstone man. in the basement as well. Oh, that's cool. awesome. Wow, that's amazing. 